What's up travelers? In this video, we're going to the oldest coffee shop in Italy. Check it out. I think we're gonna head on over to go see Marco Polo's house. So I'm standing here in front of uh, the house of Marco Polo, allegedly. <laughs> so Marco Polo may or may not have existed. We, we really don't know for sure. There isn't really a whole lot of actual record of Marco Polo on the books. We have the book, but the book was also written by the guy that wrote the Knights of the Round Table. So another bunch of people that we don't know if they actually existed or not like King Arthur, Lancelot, all of them. But the guy said that he met Marco Polo in prison and Marco Polo told him the story and he wrote the story. That was how the book of Marco Polo was, was written. So it could be fiction, it could be non-fiction, we don't know for sure. But if it was non-fiction, this right behind me is where Marco Polo lived for the last parts of his life. Pretty interesting, I think. Seeing this?
I am sitting at Cafe Florian, which is the second oldest coffee shop in the world and the oldest coffee shop in Italy. <laughs> I just ordered a 15 euro mocha. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. But this place is absolutely gorgeous and definitely it's some it's a place that you need to come check out if you're ever in Venice. So what do you get for 15 euros? Got this little tiny cup of coffee with some chocolate and some cream. You get a cookie. You get a little thing of water and a napkin. All on a really nice tray. <laughs> Check this out. All right, well, this coffee is definitely a little one for sure, but uh, let's taste the cream on top, see how that goes first. That is thick. That is insane like that. Check this out. <laughs> All right, let's give it a stir. Mm. So they topped it with some chopped up hazelnuts and man that's I would say that is the best mocha I've ever had in my life. <laughs> the chocolate doesn't overpower the coffee, the coffee doesn't overpower the chocolate, the cream just evens it out perfectly. It is just uh wow. That is great. Let's check out this little mug. I mean, that thing is cool, man. If they sell these, I might have to buy one and take one home with me. Yeah, so this place, it opened in 1720. Uh, I believe the oldest coffee shop in the world is in Paris, and it opened in 1686. Pretty big little gap there. I mean, not really if you think about it. I wouldn't suggest coming here for an everyday thing, but definitely come here for the experience. So people who have been known to come here throughout the years, Casanova, Charles Dickens, Gaith, and quite a few others, but those are like the most notable names of the that used to come here. Some of the Venetian royalty, of course, has been here. <laughs> but yeah, man, this place is awesome. And the artwork on the walls is just unbelievably beautiful. Yeah. If you've enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so every time I upload a video you get let known about it, and uh, share it with your friends. I really appreciate it and it helps me out a lot. So, sip exquisitely.